Oh. <laughs> Sorry. Hello, welcome one, welcome all. <laughs> yo, 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 welcome to the Convalescing Soul. We are keeping it interesting over here tonight, today, <laughs> whenever it is that you're viewing this. We are reading from the Hero's Journey Dream Oracle. Um, a beautiful oracle. In fact, we're reading number eight which I love number eight. It always reminds me of like an infinity symbol. Um, okay. And number eight is dream sanctuary. Attend to the simple things. There is no nudity, although the woman clearly is in a, swept up in a dreamy state, but there's no like, it's just, it's all blurry. So YouTube, we good. <laughs> We're PG here. You don't need to flag me. <laughs> um, very ethereal to me. Sorry, with the glare, I have to hold these cards at like really odd angles. Like sometimes it's like very contorted, but I want to be able to see how beautiful it is because I really appreciate the artwork on these cards. All the cards, actually. Um, I just appreciate art in general. Okay. At dusk, we encountered an elderly lady and her beagle hiking toward us, teetering along on a walking stick she wore a monitoring cap and, a, and clutched a bag. No, clutched a bunch <laughs> of wildflowers. I said hello and asked her where she was going. She replied in Welsh, Raidwa ai yim yin barod. That is my vast job <laughs> phonetically to pronounce what is on the page in front of me. We looked to Erica for translation. She said, I'm already there. And that's by Bruce Northam. Your sleep zone is your dream sanctuary, and yet you take it with you wherever you may roam. In fact, you are a dream sanctuary. You are a dreamer and your presence provides a sanctuary for you and everyone who approaches you on this path of life. Your dream zone is the orbit in which you spin, dance, live, and love. Attend to the simple things to ensure harm harmonious flow in all your relationships, and you will sleep and awaken each day with a smile on your lips. I love it when I wake up smiling, or sometimes you wake up giggling, or even sometimes I wake up and there's like a song, like I'm, there's a song I'm hearing, you know, like, I don't know if I'm singing it or, but I wake up and it, there's a song already in my head. It's kind of cool. Take inventory of anyone you need to forgive or to whom you owe an amends. Identify the attachments and behaviors. You'd be better off dropping and release them. <clears throat> Resolve clutter in your bedroom, around your nightstand, at home, and at work. I need to do that. Make room for success, happiness, prosperity, and brilliant ideas to swoop in and embrace you unencumbered. If you dream of a bedroom, your bedroom is the place in a house where the veil between worlds is the thinnest. It represents your ability to connect to both the physical and the metaphysical, for example, to dreams and waking reality. Dreams of your bed or bedroom. My dog is over there sleeping right now, probably dreaming. <laughs> <clears throat> Often symbolize your most vulnerable, authentic, transparent, sensual self. This dream may be a message to indulge in a much needed break from the intensity of your hero's journey so you can re-emerge refreshed, invigorated, energized, awake, and ready to be the hero you came here to be. Hmm. Here is your mantra. 
I am safe and free to be energetically and physically naked in my bedroom and beyond. <laughs> that is very good news, right? <laughs> Anyways, sweet dreams to all of you. <laughs> Much love and many blessings.